The nation's premier offensive lineman didn't play in the Senior Bowl, but he did play his college ball right here in Ruston at Louisiana Tech. And Willie Rofe is really an incredible story. Before his senior season, he was a virtual unknown. And now, a week before the draft, he's a certain high first-round pick. Heading into your senior year, did you have any idea that you'd be in the position you are now? No. I, I, before the senior season, in fact, in the spring, I was getting uh, uh, invitation to the hula ball and different all-star games, and I was thinking, you know, maybe with, with the spring ratings, I could be a first, second round, and I discussed that with my parents, and I knew coming into the season, I just had to go out there, finish off my blocks, stay focused, and have a real good year, but I never thought it would get to this point. No one did. He should be gone in the first five picks of the draft, which is not bad for a guy who was barely recruited coming out of high school. He is the best offensive tackle in this draft, and he's been the best offensive tackle, I think, come out the last few years. The scouts who showed up on the Tech campus to work Rofe out were looking at a guy with everything going for him. He comes from an affluent and influential Arkansas family. He's a semester away from getting his degree, and in a few days, he stands to be a very rich man. He's a guy that, that really doesn't realize how good he is. I mean, I'm... Uh, from time to time, I share things with him that, that individuals say about him, and he's always asking me, really, is, is that what they say? Is that what they think? And so, uh, in a business where egos are, are the norm, uh, he's a guy that, in a relative sense, really has none, and that's pleasant, and it makes you want to work harder for a guy like that. You never know about the draft. It's always real fishy, and, you know, you just have to do your best to lay your resume on the table and, and let, it, let the cards fall as they may. Doug Mouton for the Saints Sideline Special Edition.